Hello again everyone, this is Darkon, and this is Final Fantasy IV The After Years. When we last left off, the Castle Baron was under attack. So let's continue on and see just what the hell is going on. <coughs> Pardon me. Yep, here's Ganal. Button's broken, go figure. Where are the where are these monsters coming from? Oh, go up that way. New sandals, high potion, red fang, and ether. Let's go down one. Now, if you played Final Fantasy IV, this area looks a little familiar. Of course, these mon monsters are no match for us. I thought there might have been treasure shoved around. Sometimes there is. Said found remedy on that one. Well, let's go to the top of the tower. <coughs> Pardon me again. No one takes it one. Oh, you've been unlocked a history of violence. Guessing that depends on how many monsters we get rid of. Echo herbs. Some wine, a high potion, and heavenly wrath. Ah! Ooh, good monster. An ogre. Well, that one can take a bit of more of a hit, but usually ogres can. Not much more, though. King Cecil, get inside the keep, it's too dangerous here. Yes, it's my liege. Now let's head back outside. And we don't need to use the save point again. You okay? Um, I'm sorry, my liege. Oh, centaur. Centaur knight. The rank and file soldiers are always so weak. It's a wonder any of these castles these kingdoms and castles ever last. Cecil! Well, 
Rosa. I'm coming with you. No, you can't. I will not let you put yourself in danger. Really? After all this? That's what I'd like to say to you, Cecil. Wouldn't having a white mage by your side help you devote your full attention to fighting? Fair enough, but I want you to make me a promise. If worse comes to worse, I want you to run. Run and survive. And leave you to die? Yes, for Theodore's sake. I will. It's amazing, after all this time, he, he's saying, no, you can't go. Well, guess what, we already went to the moon, we beat evil incarnate and all that stuff, now you're saying, oh look, monsters are attacking, you can't, it's too dangerous. And now it's new moon, and that means white magic, oh, of course. I get a freaking white mage in my party and her magic is now weak. Oh well. So that's what it was. The monsters came from the air. What about the ones that can't actually fly? Cecil, look! The moon! There's one moon, and there is the second moon. That's not supposed to be there anymore. There was Rydia there, and there's Yang with another one. That's Edward, I believe. That's Edge. Is that Golbez's? Why now of all times? I love the one thing I can always say about this game. Just listen to that music. It really does something like it really means something when it starts playing gives you a sense a sense of what's going on or how meaningful it is and everything else Well, like I was saying with the music, it really does do something. Like, good music can really bring out, like, the cer certain feelings. No, I'm not talking about just simply, like, upset feelings, but just, like, it makes you think, wow, that's pretty cool. Oh, look, there's Sid. And he's pretty damn old. You're damn right, Cecil. What have you been doing this whole time? Glad to see you. Glad to see you safe, Sid. Of course I am. I haven't slowed down that much, you know. What I'd like to know, though, is where these monsters came from out of the blue. I wish I knew. Where's Theodore? He's on an expedition with the Ritlings to obtain the Knight's emblem. He ain't back yet? There's no need to worry. Biggs is there to take care of him. Well, I guess I I guess we'd better do something about this place ourselves. Wouldn't want to spoil his celebration banquet. 
Hey, cool, we got Sid in our party. Sid's always a fun guy. Let's see if he still has some of his basic abilities. Nope. Wrong one. Looking for in magic. He does have magic. Yes, all of his things are technically special abilities. Let's see if this tower has anything good in it. Nope, just... Just the beds. Three of them. I guess one of them is technically for Seodor, but... You know, they're not gonna give... They're not gonna remake the whole map just to give, uh... Just to give, like, Seodor another bedroom. We don't need to, but just in case, let's save here. The castle gates has not been breached. That means they must have flown in. Here they come! I'm not quite sure what, what ri Risk Strike does, but I do believe it's kind of like a just a uh, basic... Like, powerful chance to actually hit. Yeah, it's a, cri yeah, it's a critical one. I'm correct. No, she doesn't have anything. Blessing, if I'm correct, does the... Uh, it gives, it actually gives MP and HP if it works. At least if I recall how it worked before. Couldn't analyze it. Analyze works the same way as the uh, Libra magic. Or at least it's supposed to anyways. Well, at least we're getting a lot of gil from this. Cecil, these guys are like nothing we've fought before. I don't think there's any actual cure for the death ability. Not learned yet. Can't use it because we haven't learned it. more than one second. Oh, we learned a uh, band skill machine break. This is why I like it much better than earlier ones where you actually had to take a while to guess on which ones you learned. Yeah, it's so much easier this way. There's just no end to this. Alright, let's take a... let's see. Yep, and... Machine type enemies now is not useful. So let's just plain attack. He 
is pecking on an old man. Yes, I know that's a horrible pun, but it's the best I got. Sid, I've got a favor to ask. I'm listening. He's gonna ask him to take Rosa away. Yep, knew it. I want you to take Rosa and get out of the castle. Cecil. Baron will fall before long if this continues. Cecil. Planning to go down with the ship? I'm staying with you. These are the king's orders, Rosa. Take care of Theodor. Ah, bo ah, brother. He's always he always has to be so darn stubborn. I'm counting on you, Sid. Please. Leave it to me. Just make sure you don't get yourself killed. Got it? She does not look happy. Understandable. Oh, only both of my party. Rosa, Theodore's in your hands now, my dear. That was a very large wingspan. Bahamut? Yeah, wait, Bahamut? What the hell? Rudia? Wait, no. So you're Cecil. You know who I am? Uh, yeah, that's Bahamut. No. Why is Bahamut attacking us? He's supposed to be on our side. You know, general good guy, sort of. This is a problem. I'm pretty sure we don't have enough firepower to actually take him down. Yep, five. Countdown to our doom. Three. I wonder if we really were to work on them. Just to see if we can find any stats. Not a damn thing. Figures. Two. I doubt this would do anything, but let's uh let's defend ourselves. One. Yeah, 
I didn't think so. <laughs> Automatic, 9,999. So this is the limit of a half-breed, as expected. I mean, how the hell does she know? Where the hell is she? Oh, we're back to Reynolds. This feeling, it couldn't be that my father... Maximum speed, I don't care if we blow the engine to pieces. We're already beyond maximum output, Captain. We, we've gone off course. Critical damage to the right wing. We've lost control. Ah! Prince Theodore! Dolan, however you want to pronounce it. What is it? No, my dear Rydia, you must leave here at once. What? Why all of a sudden? There is nothing to fear. What do you want? Uh, why is she here? Isn't she attacking the castle? Your power. I am here to take it. Actually, I think this is like a prequel mix thing. I think that's what was happening, because before, if you remember, Riddy was on an airship when the attack and all that stuff was happening and the moon was showing up. I think this is a bit of like what was going on just before the attack. Okay, enough about that. We'll see about that. Bahamut is already under our control. The hallowed father of the Eidolans? Who are you? And he's turned to... Oh, well, they're both turned to statues. Ah, Edge's castle. Tower of Babel, it's back. Well, that's not a good thing. I kind of like the old version of the Tower of Babel. It was more like a collection of towers almost clumped together. I mean, this one makes more sense overall. I don't know, I guess it's just the way, I guess it's just because of nostalgia. Both look pretty good. The Dwarven Castle. King Giot, the Tower of Babel, it's... What? Yeah, this is definitely a prequel thing. Like, it's just before, like, the start of all the stuff that was going on. I think this is, like, a mix of what the interlude had and, uh, the actual tales. I can't quite remember because I haven't played the other, the original version of this in a long while. Ooh, the ship's not in good pieces. <laughs> okay, that was the odd words. Yeah, it's just com a complete wreck. Captain Biggs! Captain Biggs, you put your life on the line for me. If I, if I was more of a soldier, you wouldn't be like this right now. C Captain Biggs. I don't think any of them have survived. Hey. Hey. Hang. Hang in there. He's dead. Wedge! The 
they're dead. All of them. Now, just to break, break it for a moment, their names are Biggs and Wedge. I was fully expecting them to die. <laughs> if you take a look at any game that has the names Biggs and Wedge, and that's a complete spoof off of yeah, Star Wars as well, with Biggs and Wedge as well, or one way or the other, if their names are Biggs and Wedge, they ain't gonna live. Let's be honest. <laughs> Or maybe not. Huh? Okay, he's not quite dead. Prince Theodore, you're unharmed, aren't you? Stop talking, I'll go find somebody to help. Help! Anyone! Sorry. I couldn't get you back to Baron safely, my prince. Captain Biggs. Now go... Now go. Hurry. Away from here. I can't do that, Captain Biggs. I'm... I'm still a squire. You can't expect me to... I can't do it on my own. Just a squire? We are the Red Wings, the pride of Baron. Must we now be thieves sent to plunder from the weak? Enough. But Captain, the Mycidians offered no resistance, and still we cut them down. Theodore, listen to me. So those, were, so that was Biggs and Wedge from the first one. You must return to our beloved Baron, no matter the cost. This is my final order. Yes, sir. Good. That's what that's what it means to be a knight of the Red Wings. He has a smile on his face. I'm talking about Biggs. Yes, sir. You're the last of the Red Wings, Theodore. Guess the title now makes sense. We, the Red Wings, are the greatest airship fleet in the skies, the pride of Baron. To be fair, they're the only airship fleet in the skies. I mean, literally, they're they're quite literally the only airship fleet. There is no other fleet. My orders are the law to you. Theodore of the Red Wings of Baron. Well, now return to Baron, sir. Definitely. I am a member of the Red Wings. I can't let it end like this. Oh, 
Oh, that was unexpected. Guy with the big scimitar. Still alive? Yes. Thank you. Are you alright? He didn't look completely useless back there, but taking on a monster like that is suicidal. I... I can do it. I must get back to Baron, no matter the cost. With no airship? Yes, even with no airship. I am a member of the Red Wings of Baron. I don't need an air I don't need an airship to lay claim to that. Ah. You've heard of them? Who hasn't heard of them would be a better question. That's the most famous unit in Baron's military. You best be careful though. The monsters are restless ever since the trouble. Trouble? Don't tell me that you don't know. The war that raged across this land once. Yes, I know now. My mother and father often told me about it. We can reach Baron from Isidia in the west. Is there a ship there? Something even better than that. I'll show you the way. Are you sure? I have business of my own in Baron. Urgent business. My, I, my name is Theodore. I don't have a name. No, I abandoned it long ago. Huh? Aren't you in a hurry? The Hooded Man has joined the party. Bit obvious. Oh, look, there's the map. Uh, up, you can see up on the top right there, roughly, the cave in the town where we were. Well, I am going to end it there for the moment. This is Darkon, and this was Final Fantasy IV The After Years. Theodore's Tale. If you did enjoy this, please like, favor, subscribe, if you, or leave a comment below. I do enjoy hearing from people. And I hope to see you next time for more Final Fantasy IV The After Years. Bye!